Okay, so today we've got a brand new uh, out of the box Galaxy 959. This one was made in May of 2020, and we are going to look at its sideband linearity straight from the factory. So, this is the factory alignment, and uh, I've been going through a few of my Galaxy radios that are brand new in my radio closet. I'm pulling them out of the box and looking at their linearity, and I'm seeing the uh, the same thing on all of them when it comes to sideband. They are just way overpowered. So we're going to take a look at this one and see if it's the same. So I'm going to put this box aside here, and I've already got a two-tone test generating over here, and uh, we've got her on channel. Let's put her on channel 19 and uh power is all the way up rf gain is all the way up make mic gain is all the way up we are in lower sideband clarifier centered and we're going to generate our two tones and we're going to look up here uh let's see we'll look over here and see what our average power is first so here we go we're keying up so average power is over scale we're on this so it's putting out 16 watts average right now and let's look at her on the oscilloscope yeah what in the world is that look at that mess it's crazy that they're coming from the factory like this okay so we're gonna uh we're gonna make some adjustments yeah that's horrible well let's take a look and see what um what she looks at like an am let me change this back over Let's see. Let me shut all that off. And we're going to go frequency. All right. So now we're just going to generate a 1 kilohertz tone, 30 millivolts. Um, we are back in AM on the radio. So let's look at our AM waveform. There she is. Eh, not bad. Just a side banner. All these, uh, these galaxies are just so overdriven. That looks fine. Um, what would that be as far as percentage modulation? Let's let's throw it into here and look. So we'll look and see right here on our AM depth what she's looking like. All right. So here we go. All right. So it's showing eighty nine percent. Yeah, I believe it. That's what that looked like to me. It didn't look like it was 100%, which, again, I'm fine with. I don't like overdriving my radios. 100% modulation to me is even a little too much. So, yeah. Yeah, looks fine. I mean, you could you could adjust it. You could get some more modulation out of it stock if you wanted to. I don't know. All right, so we'll go ahead and, uh, we'll go ahead and crack the case open on this, and we'll see if we can uh, do something about that uh, sideband. 16 watts average 16 watts rms and it should be about 11 watts peak this thing shouldn't be doing more than five watts six watts at most rms on sideband so we'll go ahead and um we'll go ahead and pop the cover so we'll be back in a couple minutes okay so we're back with the uh galaxy 959 stock 959 you can see this thing still, I, I mean, it's, like I said, it's brand new out of the box. You st we still got the uh, plastic graph on the uh, case covers. Uh, let me turn this over underneath here. Okay, and uh, yeah, she's just a virgin radio on the inside. Nothing's ever been done to this radio. This is what it looks like from the factories, folks. No, no surprises here. Um, wiring's not bad. It's pretty clean the way they tied it up. All right, so uh, let's um, let's just start by turning that power down. All right, uh, let's give us something to start with, and just see if we can even get a get an idea. Oh, I hold on, let me get this set back up for uh, for um, sideband two tone test here. Okay. All right. So we got a two tone test going. All right. So let's just start with power. 
Oh, hold on. I'm still in AM. Let me try that again. All right, so now we're in lower side, man. 20 watt scale over there. Jesus. We are at 16 watts right now. That is insane. We're going to bring that down. I'm going to bring that all the way down here to about 5 watts. We're going to start with that. Now look at our waveform. Jesus, it's still just so flat topped. All right, what else can we do with it here? See if we can keep shaping it. Oh, just dropped it. Oh, look at that, though. That looks a lot better. All right, let's see if we can work with that. All right, we're shaping it just a little bit at a time. Trying to keep ourselves linear. Just a little at a time here. All right, getting closer. Now I could live with that. That's not too bad there. That's not too bad at all. All right, so. I'll tell you what, now what we'll do, we'll stick that into, um, oh, well, you saw what it was doing now, average power. So now we've got it down to just about six watts, and that is now what our linearity looks like. Okay, so let's take that, and let's put that into our IFR 1200 over here, and just look at our peak, see what our peak watts are now. So we're over here, we're on the... 15 watt peak scale over here on the right. So let's see. Let me find my switch. Okay, so look, see, we're still 14 watts. So, all right, cool. That means we've got some room to be a little more linear than we even are there. So I'm going to come back over here. I'm going to see if I can shape that a little more. All right, let's see what we can do. Oop, wrong way. All right. That looks like about five watts average on the nose. All right, let's stick that back into the IFR 1200 one more time and see what how close we are to 11 watts peak but that looks pretty nice okay so we're still sitting at about 13 watts peak all right so let me uh we'll just watch it over here and i'm going to take that down a little bit more up oh, wrong way let's see let's set it right at 11. okay that's about 11 there I think. Kind of hard to tell from my angle. Yeah, it's about 11. Okay. Let's look at that again on the oscilloscope and see what we've done. Now, that looks really nice, but I still think we should go a little bit. Let's go a little more. Let's take a little more. I'm going to put it back to that 5 watts average. There we go. All right. Now, much better. Uh, how's that going to sound? I don't know. Let's go to our monitor radio here. we got our 2547 up there set to lower sideband. Let me grab a mic. We'll see how close to being on frequency we are. Might have to make an adjustment there. I don't know. Okay, here we go. Let's just see what it sounds like. Check, check, check. One, two, check. One, two. Actually, didn't sound bad. All right. Well, how about uh, upper side band? How's that sound? Hello, one, two. Check, check, check. All right, that's a little off. Okay, so let's. Uh, well, here, let's listen to AM real quick. Hello, check, check, check. Up. Oh. 
put that back to AM on 2547. Oh, check, check, check. All right, so lower sideband and AM sound good. We need to do a slight adjustment for upper sideband. So let me do that real quick, and then I'll come back, and um, we'll look at receive on this thing. All right, we'll be back. All right, we're back. We made a quick adjustment to uh, our upper side band uh, transmit here's we'll just let you hear it real quick on the monitor radio over there 2547 check 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 hello one two yeah so she sounds a lot better now all right so uh, I guess that's really about it so you see what I mean we we're not gonna bother going through receive uh, most of these galaxies uh, do really well on receive right out of the factory so I'm not gonna bother messing with that I really just wanted to show the, uh, again, another brand new in the box, uh, Galaxy 959, Virgin 959, and it's uh, SSB linearity from the factory, which is just absolute poo-poo. So I don't know, maybe if enough of us uh, start putting them on Front Street on YouTube, uh, they'll uh, take a look at what their procedure is over there and start training their technicians to... Uh, to do it the right way. I mean, that's all I could think. I don't know. Or maybe they'll never do anything about it. But, I mean, just so you know, if you buy one of these, um, that's what you're looking forward to as far as your sideband performance. So uh, keep that in mind. So I guess that's about it. Then we'll uh, we'll leave it there. So uh, cheers to everybody. 73s. We'll see you next time.